how to hook it up. So, what do we have today? Um, so you got all you knew. I have this angel eye that I installed it a few weeks ago, but I never get a chance to connect, supply all the wiring, all this light bulb. So today I'm gonna try to run the wiring cable down the firewall. It's gonna have to do a layer drilling. It's just this two layer piece of cable and just kind of drill and connect to the one of the switch I have. I will have the switch inside. I already knew I had this switch right here. Everything, most of the things installed already. I got mid injection, radio, nitrous on, nitrous purge. And this two right here, I did not connect any, have anything connects to it yet. So I'm just gonna use that too for those light bulb. One switch for the light bar and one of those for the angel eye. See right here this thing. 4K, I mean uh yeah, it is 4K white, kinda like bluish, and this is more like purple pink, I would say. Yeah, you'll see the result as soon as I finish everything. So yeah. Uh, first of all, look at it and mine and the engine bay a little bit before I start it. Okay. So the car parking out here is hot in the sun. I got no option. I have no garage and I moved to this new place. I have to park the car close to the house, but it's still deal with the sun cover, but it's not 100% you know, heat protected. Cosmetic paint chip. Fade out. I deal with all that stuff right now, but I'm not too worried about that. You know, it's as importantly as the car. I need the car to run solid, beat on it, and I'm gonna deal with all the cosmetic as soon as I move out from the area. But yeah, as you can see, it's fully built V2. I got cam 22 cam, block fully built, solid block boil from 3.5 liters to 3.7 and see what I have uh, new piston rod today I'm not I'm not gonna try to explain all this you know all the part and everything yet so but yeah it's just that's just a little it's a little run through just in case everyone, you know, everybody cares what I have in here. It's fully built, V2, WD rev up, originally, and it still is V2, WD rev up, original engine, block, and everything is original, it's just bored to 3.7. Yeah, let me get a start right now on drilling. I'm, I would have to make a little hole right here. And that I would have to drill from the inside because hardly have any space from the outside to even reach up to it. And I will have to splice those as soon as I got those cables, those wires. I have to splice it to another switch I have, and that switch is pretty much it's gonna be you know controllably. Turn on and off as I wanted to. It doesn't have to be stay at on. So what I did after I made a drill through the firewall right there, I just use this wire that I had, old wire, and just kind of shove it in. Then it's like that. And then shove it in. And then you just use 
exactly. Might you gonna see over here is coming out as you stick from the inside. And just hook to it, something hook to it, pull it up, and after you're just gonna kind of tape to it to the cable that the wire that you're gonna run through it. And yeah, that's about it. I'm just gonna tape to the one I'm planning on running to it. After that, I'm gonna try to cut down. It's probably, obviously, it's gonna be a little too long, but I'll cut it down as soon as I get to the length that I reach to. So it's ready. Basically, ready. Everything installed. Slice, connector, and everything. You're gonna see this light bar, the long stripe light, light bar, and an angel eye. Both side. I'm gonna turn it on right now. So, and now you basically it's like that. So I'm gonna turn it on. Let's see the difference right now. So I have this switch right here. So first you gotta turn it on and then it's That's for the angel eye and for the light bulb. There it is. So I don't know if you can see in the camera that it's more like purple which Almost like pink. Yeah. Yeah. You got LED inside too. It's kind of white blues. 4K. You hardly can see right now. It's, it's too bright out here. Probably at night time you'll see clay. But yeah. That looks good though. They're pretty dope. Like. Turn it off just pretty much switching it just like that to switch to turn it off everything that's a switch right here top switch that's when you could start you know manually put on whatever you want to turn on at first you got to turn on the top switch main switch now it's turned off completely Everything is set. We're finished. So for the next few days, Street G35 is going to be sitting here for a while. Well, it was like five days. I would say that's kind of a little while. Until I get this mic taken care of. One of the homies is dealing with some, develop some fire that I mentioned. And should be ready in the next few days or so. And I'm just gonna bring the car in and ASAP here taking care of it. Get all the certificate done and I bring it to DMV. After that, it's got my sticker. Well, it's gonna be getting my sticker as soon as I got all the smart taken care of. But yeah, let's wait for it. It's kinda hot out here. It is what it is though. I have to park the car out here is deal with the sun, heat, so called kind of problem to the paint job, but it's, it's all good for now. The 
engine bay look clean though, stay clean. Except the paint job on the outside. It's a little chipped out. It's a little fade out. I'm not too worried about the paint job. Cosmetics, I can get it fixed. Just make sure the car running solid. And we are set. 